Welcome to Tour Tip Tuesday. We are talking about early extension. Some people need it, some people don't, and I'm gonna give you the reasons why for both of them. So it all determined by your trail hand grip, for right hand grip for the right handers. If you have a certain type of grip, you need to stay in posture. And if you have another type of grip, you need to stand up through the ball to create the room. So, which one's you? So this is where we talk about there's three ways to do everything in the golf swing. A lot of it all relates to the right hand grip. So if you have a strong right hand grip, which I mean V points to the right shoulder, that's a strong right hand grip. In the swing, you are gonna come down, you're gonna tuck the right elbow and you are gonna stay in posture. So we're gonna come down and you are gonna be in that look, the elbows, tuck the elbows in front of the hip the butt is back here, so you are staying in posture through the ball. Someone like Dustin Johnson does that perfectly. Lots of side bend to the right, elbow tucks in and goes that way. So, they're the people, right hand grip. How do you get the right hand grip? If on my previous videos, the test, clap your hands together, swing your arm to the right. Now, if this right elbow is lower than the left, it's in front of you this way, you need a strong right hand grip. Therefore, you need to tuck the elbow coming down and stay in posture this way. Most of the time your shot pattern will be little draws, but people do also fade it from that. That's for another video down the track. Now for the people that have got a neutral grip, someone like Tiger Woods, Justin Rose, they're still gonna stay in a little bit of posture. They're not gonna move out this way, but the right elbow is on the side of the hip instead of in front of the hip, so it's on the side here and they'll have a slight little early extension. Nothing major, but again, there is a very slight one. Now for the people that actually need early extension are the people that have got the weak right hand grip. Rory McIlroy, classic example. Jack Nicholas, how's that? Early extends, so there you go. Louis Oosthausen, early extends. Mark Leishman, early extends. So there's a few people that do it. Not everyone needs to go this way. So, for the people that need to early extend, the ones that've got the weak right hand grip. Again, testing it. Elbow goes back and up. It doesn't tuck under. Goes back and up. That means you need a weak right hand grip. I'm the same pattern, so I need to give it the old stand up through the ball. So what happens for those people that have got the weak right hand grip, the right elbow is behind them here. The club's gonna look slightly across the line. On the way down, the elbow is behind the hip. So now you've got no room. So what you need to do is actually stand up to let the club release and go through. Now, the problem is, if people are trying to reduce early extension and they've got the weak right hand grip, and your elbow's back here and you stay in posture, boom, you're gonna hit that thing fat. So all of a sudden, there's a knock-on effect in what everything is. So just remember, strong right hand grip, tuck the elbow, stay in posture. Neutral grip, pretty very similar. Stay in posture, a little bit of side bend. People that have got the weak right hand grip, early extension, worst, uh, early extension is what you need. Staying in posture is the worst thing for you. So early extension, you need to stand up through the ball. That creates room, that allows the club to release earlier closes the club face, go down. Normally that will give you a little fade shot as well. As I said in previous videos, there's three ways to do everything in the swing. So three different types of grips, tells you if you need early extension or not. Now I'm gonna say for the people that grip it with a weak right hand and you are trying to stay in posture and tuck the elbow, your miss will be a thin right or a pull draw. Now, if you're getting both of the, one of those or either of those in the golf game, send me a message and I'll explain how we can fix that. Again, I am teaching on the Skillist app. So if you'd like some help with your golf game, please send me a message. If you've got any comments, please don't hesitate to send a comment. Also remember, if you like the video, hit like, subscribe and the notification bell you'll be getting a video every Tuesday. Also, I'm gonna put things up on Saturday. It's gonna be a short game Saturday.